our next inductee secured his lofty place in international basketball history after leading his homeland Argentina to glory at the Athens Olympic Games. It was a confirmation of his greatness and the awe-inspiring talent of the players, most of whom had reached the final of the FIBA Basketball World Cup two years before in Indianapolis. Let's take a look. Wow, an exceptional life achievement. Now please welcome Mr. Ruben Menyano from Argentina. Thank you very much indeed. It's a great pleasure and a source of enormous pride to be able to share today with all of you what is one of the happiest days of uh, my life as a basketball coach. I have shared with uh, real leading lights of the world basketball. Just a month ago, Mr. Horacio Moratore sent a communication to inform me that I had been selected to be inducted in the Hall of Fame. Now this was a unique, inexplicable moment of my life. And it led me to think about a few questions, a few issues. It has to do with the nature of challenge and what allows you to believe in what's really a utopia, where you break paradigms. where you can arrive and you can com continue to grow. Now, I felt that I had to do something that I very rarely do, and that is to look back. I always like to look forward, to look to the future and new challenges and goals, but this time, as I say, I felt obliged to turn my head and look back to see where I had come from. This journey with so much passion and so much effort. A journey which, of course, I did not walk alone. I was accompanied by a huge number of people who were with me through every step of the way in my life as a trainer, as a coach. Certainly, happy moments. And to come into the Hall of Fame is a cause of great honour. It's a cause of great pleasure, of great pride. And doing this also makes me think, and I think it brings out from me one of the most pure distinctions that we can have, which is that of gratitude. Thanking, giving thanks really to the three basic pillars that support the life of a coach. My family, Patricia, my wife, Sofia and Francisco, my children, These really are the people that uh, 
provide all the support that I need and of course me a lot of security and trust trust placed in me by the leaders clubs associations federations confederations acceptance by the players they are the real raw material in this whole business so i am convinced that without this acceptance a coach can really not very do very much i don't want to forget one a vital poll which is coaches all the coaches that have accompanied me throughout these years now without any doubt i strongly embrace this award this recognition which i did not expect it's exciting it's unforgettable i will never forget this for the rest of my life thank you fiba thank you basketball